Once upon a time, in a small village nestled by the shimmering sea, there lived a humble family, a mother, a father, and their young son. Their days were filled with the ebb and flow of the ocean, for the parents were fishermen, casting their nets each day in hopes of a bountiful catch, but alas, fate had dealt them a difficult hand. Some days, the sea offered little, and their nets returned empty. Other days, when the weather turned fierce, they were forced to stay ashore, their boats rocking restlessly in the turbulent waves. Mom and Dad, I'm so hungry. My tummy hurts so much. Their son, too young to join them on their perilous trips, could only watch from the shore as his parents battled the elements. And on days when their luck ran dry, their meager meals consisted of nothing more than plain rice sprinkled with salt. Until when we have to live like this, I'm so hungry. I will think of something to change our lives. One day, as the boy played along the sandy shoreline, he stumbled upon a group of young men, their hands filled with shimmering seashells. Curious, he approached them and asked what they were doing. What are they doing here? Maybe it's okay for me to ask. With a smile, one of the men explained that they were harvesting shellfish, a lucrative trade in these parts. They spoke of selling both the shellfish and the shells themselves, their eyes gleaming with tales of prosperity, inspired by their words, a spark ignited within the boy's mind. He raced home, his pockets brimming with sea shells, eager to share his newfound idea with his parents, but when he arrived, he was met with stern faces and scolding words. Night had fallen and they worried for his safety as he ventured out alone. Yet as he explained his plan, a glimmer of hope flickered in their eyes, with little choice but to trust in their son's vision, the family set to work, transforming their humble abode into a makeshift workshop. Together, they fashioned necklaces, bracelets, and intricate house decorations from the treasures of the sea. The next day, armed with their creations, they ventured out to the bustling beachfront, where tourists from far and wide gathered to soak in the sun and surf. With a smile and a steady hand, the boy approached each passerby, offering his wares with pride, and lo and behold, one tourist was particularly enchanted by their craftsmanship. Impressed by the boy's talent, he made an offer that would change their lives forever, to exclusively sell their creations in his shop, dedicated to coastal decor, with newfound purpose and determination, the family embraced their new venture wholeheartedly. No longer shackled by the whims of the greedy middleman, they flourished, their crafts adorning homes far and wide. And so, against all odds, a family once burdened by poverty found their path to prosperity, their hearts filled with gratitude for the treasures the sea had bestowed upon them. And as the waves whispered their tales of triumph, they knew that together, they could weather any storm that came their way. As the family's newfound business began to thrive, so too did the jealousy of a rival merchant, known for his underhanded dealings and cutthroat tactics. This is not possible. They will regret soon. One fateful day, as the family proudly displayed their creations on the beach, the rival merchant approached them with a devious grin. He offered them a deal too good to refuse, a partnership that promised wealth beyond their wildest dreams. But the boy, sensing something amiss, hesitated. He remembered the stories his parents had told him of the merchant's deceitful ways and decided to trust his instincts. Mom and Dad. Please don't forget what he did to us. Don't believe him. With a polite refusal, the merchant's smile turned to a scowl and he vowed revenge against the family who dared to defy him. 
Weeks passed, and the family's success only continued to grow. Their creations became sought after far and wide, and their small workshop buzzed with activity, but one stormy night, disaster struck. Their workshop was set ablaze, engulfed in flames that licked hungrily at their precious creations. As the family watched in horror, they knew that their livelihood was in ruins. Oh my God! Our house! How are we going to continue making our crafts? We don't even have house now. Where are we going to stay? This is so heartbreaking. But just as all hope seemed lost, a familiar face emerged from the shadows, the tourist who had first discovered their talent. With a twinkle in his eye, he revealed himself to be none other than a wealthy entrepreneur, with connections to artisans and markets across the globe, moved by their resilience and determination. He offered to help rebuild their workshop and expand their business, promising to protect them from any further harm. With their spirits renewed and their faith restored, the family embraced this unexpected twist of fate. Together, they embarked on a new journey, one filled with even greater opportunities and adventures beyond their wildest dreams. And so, with the support of newfound friends and allies, our heroes emerged stronger than ever before, proving that even in the face of adversity, love, perseverance, and a sprinkle of sea magic can conquer all.